Welcome to my channel, Connection of Lives and Interests. I am making my daughter's favorite mashed potatoes. Now she's vegan, so we use vegan butter. Uh, this isn't the one that I prefer, but they haven't been selling the one I prefer at the local stores here. I don't know what it is, but I know it when I see it. So I already used it last time she was here. Uh, I always use at least a half container of the vegan butter in a container. I don't know how many sticks I would need, so I just buy the container because that's that's what works. So, Mr. Thumbs Up, he washed and peeled and put the potatoes in sugar water, which keeps them white until I'm ready to cook them. And then I drain it and I Put in plain water when it's time to cook it. So if you didn't know how to stop your veggies from browning, you just add sugar water until you're ready to cook them up. Now I did get a new container today and more butter is better. I know a lot of you like to use the real butter stuff. My sister does too. And yes, it is very delicious, but it's very expensive. So that's one of the things we don't spend money on. And like my daughter said, this vegan butter is harder than others that we've had, and you have to put it out sooner. And yes, lots of butter, y'all, um, for it to soften. And I didn't think about it ahead of time. So, and I'm getting it with my little rubber spatula. And I used to mash it and then whip it with a, a blend, um, mixer. But now I don't do that. I just mix it with a mixer. So I add as much butter as I want. And then I add more as I go along. We no longer use milk we use almond milk and i just i don't measure anything i just go by look and feel and these are the only two ingredients that i use in it and i like to i'm saying and a lot thanks a lot nona grace you may, <laughs> i don't think i was saying it until you said, Nona Grace, if you haven't watched her channel, her and her husband, Jim, make videos daily. They uh, made one recently where she said, have you ever noticed how many times people say and or um? I'm telling you, I have been saying it a lot since she did that to me. <laughs> so I can't pause this, so block your ears. you can always add more but you can't take it out so you want to make sure that you try it let's see buttery 
but I need more seasoning, just like I thought. How many of you have ever accidentally opened the pour one end of a seasoning and didn't realize it and poured it on something and try to scoop as much of it off as you could? Oh, that's not fun. And that would have been hilarious if I just did that on camera, thinking I shut that one, but I shut the other one. I think that's good. I mean, if I wanted to, I could count the shakes, but I've never done it. I just, and and this is, this is where it's at, y'all. This is really, really good. And it, it could be like you add so much per uh, potato. I currently have five potatoes in here. Oh, and I'm gonna go ahead and, well, I'll mix it and then I'll do the more milk. So now that should be good to go. Make sure it smells good and looks good. So we're having this tomorrow. So Memorial Day with my daughter and her boyfriend. We're gonna have corn on the cob on the grill and we're gonna be cooking kielbasa, hot dogs, hamburgers, and she's bringing her vegan meat and we have a special mat that we put on the grill so it's not cross contaminating with the regular foods. Nice and creamy, buttery, and seasons, seasonings, <laughs> not seasons. And the best part about making it the day ahead is that the seasons can all get together and get along and make a nice flavor for us on the day of use. <laughs> So I am going to try it, but I know it's ready. And the thing is, is uh, the next day you might want to add more almond milk and butter because try that. Got another clean spoon. Did you hear me shut the drawer? Mm-hmm. Yep. Oh, this is the best yet. Mr. Thumbs up, you want a bite? I think this is the best yet. So, it's, oh, he's coming for it. Here you go. That is awesome. Yeah. And that's with the butter that I don't care for. So this time it was really good, but I put more seasoning in. Oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> um, Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. I hope you join my channel. I have something for everybody and I hope you'll ring that bell so you don't miss any upcoming notifications because you never know what I might share next. Happy cooking, everybody. Be kind, be nice, be encouraging no matter where you are through the internet. We can touch lives, we can make a difference, we can make people smile, laugh, and give encouraging words. And we can have fun cooking and crafting and creating together. Thanks for watching. Bye.